What do you think about recreational marijuana and the medical marijuana vote? Should recreational marijuana be legalized? And what about your medical marijuana vote? Public opinion in the United States and several countries in Europe and Latin America are grappling with this controversial issue. Medical marijuana is a growing industry. More and more people are hearing about this marijuana vote that has been sweeping our nation. Medical marijuana bills have legally been adopted in numerous states and even federal government in the District of Columbia. And, as most know, Colorado and Washington have fully legalized marijuana for recreational use by adults. This is really groundbreaking, said Bo Kilmer, co-director of the Rand Drug Policy Center. No modern jurisdiction has ever removed the prohibition on the production and possession of marijuana for recreational purposes. Since no one has done this before, there are a lot of uncertainties. There are several opinions against marijuana use in general, and on the opposite side, you will hear positive arguments about the usage of marijuana. A good example is to take a look back at our own history. We've all heard history repeats itself, and look at the prohibition of alcohol. Alcohol was considered evil, and the government made it illegal, and that was what provided the foundation for the mob to make millions of tax-free money or that by having a vote to legalize marijuana would increase tax revenues for the government and to not make it as profitable on the black market to discourage where most of it is actually sold today. You might have heard the recent actions of Congress Representatives Von Nurmer and Polis released a report outlining the need for federal marijuana law reform. It was titled The Path Forward, Rethinking Federal Marijuana Policy. An effort is building in Congress to make a marijuana vote that would change United States laws, including moves to legalize the production of the industrial hemp and create a federal tax. It introduces federal measures to legalize cannabis that would allow states and voters to decide if they will regulate marijuana in a similar manner to alcohol. Ending marijuana prohibition by regulating it like alcohol is said that it will generate tens of millions of dollars in tax revenue for state and local governments in this growing industry. Alan St. Pierre, executive director of Normal, a national group that lobbies for the legalization, said he has heard from friends and family already planning trips to Colorado for the quote-unquote cannabis tourism that will certainly become popular. It is necessary to consider how marijuana and medical marijuana legalization is creating a totally unique industry in the United States and how it will impact parents, heavy users, medical users, employers, state and local economies, and even the drug traffickers. Let us know what you think.